But Dr. Day, why do these growths occur? They can be genetic, but they often tend to occur in areas of high friction, like the neck, under the arms, and the groin. And they can get very irritated from clothing and jewelry and just rubbing. And what do you have to worry about? You typically don't. It's always good to show your dermatologist to make sure they're just benign growths. But otherwise, unless they get irritated, you really don't need to do anything about them. All right, so Nicole from the audience is joining us. She has some concerns about her skin tags. Welcome. Hello. So, so what's bothering you about your skin? Well, I actually didn't even know I had it until someone pointed it out to me. And now it just drives me crazy. I feel it all the time. I touch it. I know it's there. So how large can these growths get? Which, which, can we take a look at it while we do this? Sure. sure. It can be as small as a sunflower seed, but I've seen them get as big as the size of a fig. And they size can, of a fig? Yeah, sometimes I think they need their own outfits. I mean, it's just <laughs> extra arms and legs for them. But they, um, they can get pretty big and, and uncomfortable. And in the area like the neck, jewelry can rub against it, and uh, it can get pretty irritating. So yeah. this one looks like it's been there for a while, but now it just reached a size where things are bothering her. And how do you know that it's been there for a while? It has a little hair growing out of it. And that's a sign that it's been there. Yeah. That's an important clue, everybody. Now it's at home. And it's also a sign that it's okay. Yes, it's also a good sign. Uh, but a really easy fix is is found at the doctor's office. So, so Dr. Day, what, what, are you, what are your thoughts about being able to remove something like this? You know, this is one of the th fun things that we do in our offices. We like to snip. So this is a great old scissor. You can't try this at home. It's not Just using can a regular scissor. Yeah, yeah. You ready? Okay. So we basically, I'm just going she, to. She's numbed this up, by the way. Yeah. Dr. Day, numb this up before we. Yeah, we're, we're nice, actually. <laughs> so we, we just gently remove it. You... And then we just burn the base so it doesn't come back. And then I just burn the base so that it doesn't scar and it doesn't come back. And this doesn't hurt her at all.